Hey you guys, I'm coming to you guys today to do a video on how to remove dark spots super quick and easy. Um, now before I start this video, this only will work if you got dark spots recently. So say you just had like a breakout like last week and then they just healed and you just start to see the dark spots kind of come up. This is only going to help that like it, it won't really work good if you have dark spots for a long period of time if you have dark spots for a long period of time it will help but it won't help like remove them pretty much completely or to the point where you can't even see them um so just fyi because i don't want people to try this and they're like oh my gosh like it's not working so if you have dark spots for a long time i will use some of these items to help you kind of start your journey to get rid of them but i wouldn't use them to completely think like they're gonna go away completely but if you are like me and you don't really get dark spots all the time, you only get them when you have like one big pimple or two big pimples, then this will work really good for you. But make sure that if you're going to use these things that I'm talking to you guys about, you use them as soon as the pimple is like clear and you see a dark spot come up, you have to start using that stuff immediately or at least a week after. Because if you use it a long time after, you may not get the results that I got. So just FYI. Okay, so um, again, so if you guys watch my skincare transformation video, I talked to you guys a little bit how I do um, suffer from getting deep, big pimples on my chin. I don't know why I get them. Um, I have very sensitive skin um, on my face, especially on my chin. So I have to be very careful with if I do use products. Now I kind of got to the point where I don't even like to put any type of makeup or highlight or anything on my chin because I will break out like I used to highlight my chin and you know my nose and under my eyes but I always got big pimples so it's something that I always kind of been dealing with forever since I hit puberty and every time I get it I always get um, a dark spot on my chin and it's something I've been dealing with and I always have to deal with the dark spot and I always used to put a whole bunch of makeup to try to cover and it just made me get more pimples on my chin so it's something that I've been dealing with for a long time but um uh, recently, um, I do have a job, and within my job is a makeup store. I decided to try out some products um, that had to do with brightening and dark spots, and they really worked really good for me. So I kind of want to do this video about it. So let me get what I use to kind of start it off when you have a dark spot. Now, if you guys saw my video, you saw that I had a dark spot on my chin, and as you can see now, it's pretty much non-noticeable you really can't even tell that i have a dark spot anymore so what the first thing that i started to do was like i have to get through that first layer of skin and kind of get deep and down like inside of my skin because with you have any type of mark where there's a dark mark whether it's a stretch mark whatever you have to get past that first layer and you have to get deep inside that's the only way you're gonna see results so first thing that i decided to try out was some philosophy and it's like a Skin pillar. It's not like the strong acidic skin pill where it like makes you look like you're freaking Frankenstein. No, it's like a very light kind of skin pill. And all you do is you have like a liquid form. It comes in like a little package. Like it's like a pack you buy it together. It is expensive. All these products that I'm showing you guys are expensive. You don't have to get all of them. You can get one or the other and just use that and then get like a cheaper kind of lightning cream or you can use more expensive lightning thing and then you can get like a cheap like a homemade scrub it's really up to you but i just want to show you things that i've been kind of trying out and been working for me but this is the philosophy scrub and all you do is it has like an activating clear gel which this is how it looks it's activating clear gel and then has a scrub and this is how the scrub looks and all you do is what i do is i mix them together so i put a little bit of the scrub on my face and then i put a little bit of the activating on wherever the dark spot is and I kind of scrub it on and I leave it on for, I only leave it on for three minutes. Some people leave it on longer. I really feel like you only should leave it on for three to five minutes because if you don't, you could run the risk of it burning your skin and that will do more damage than good. So don't leave it on too long. Leave it on for three to five minutes because you don't want to damage your skin even more than what it is. Do that, just rinse it off with like warm water or whatever. And then after that, you then can take whatever kind of lightning, um, corrector whatever you want to use some people use toners some people use um, other creams these are the three items that I've tried and I like all of them and you again you don't have to get all three of them but you can at least try one out and see if you like it but I want to give you guys three different options 
um, just to show you guys the different things that you can do, whatever, for um, dark spots. So, yeah, so the first um, thing I want to show you guys is called D Spot, and this is from, I believe, um, O. Hendrickson. I believe is he from O. Hendrickson? I think it's O. Hendrickson. It's called D Spot. Um, he, I might get his name wrong, but that's the name of the um, brand is um, D Spot. And the first one I got is the stronger one, and this is the um, strongest one, and it comes in like a brown kind of nasty. It looks really nasty. And this is how it looks. It's the stronger of the one, and this one has actual lightning in it. It's very strong. It has like the actual lightning. Like if you if you get lightning cream from the doctor, it has a little bit of that in it, so it makes it a little bit more stronger. Um, and you put this on your dark spot. I've been using this one a lot more just because I wanted the dark spot gone quickly and in hurry because I just don't like having anything on my face. So I wanted it quick and in hurry. So I use this one. I like it a lot. I actually notice results. You notice results in a week and then when you use it in two weeks you pretty much are good to go. You pretty much are happy with what you see. Um, the only thing I hate about this product is that it stinks. It smells so nasty and the reason why it smells so bad is because it does have that brightening component into it like the actual medicine and it smells so bad I, don't even, I didn't even like putting it on my face because i felt like it just stunk and it just smelled like blood or something i don't know what it smelled like but it smells so bad so yeah that's the only thing about this one it's strong and it will get the job done quicker but it stinks so the next item that's really good for lightning dark spots is this one and this is d spot again and this is the actual, like, this is the D-Spot, but it doesn't have that lightning medicine component in it. It does help lightening, but it's not going to be as strong as the other one, meaning that it's not going to get the job done as quickly. If you want something that's not so strong, because with the other one, you do have to use a sunscreen. You do have to be careful um, because you don't want it. It just, you don't want it to get dark again, so you have to use sunscreen and all that stuff like that. But this one is still recommended, but you don't have to do as much to it because it's kind of, it's not as strong and it's not going to do as much in one time as the other one is. So if you want something that's going to do the job, but take a little longer and you don't have to worry about sunscreen and stuff like that, I would check out the regular D-Spot, not the one with the 3% whitening because it will get the job done, but it's going to do it at a slower pace. And it's not, and it's really, I would try this too if you have sensitive skin. Um, I have sensitive skin, but it, that, um, D-Spot didn't really do anything or damage anything or, like, make me break out. But if you're really terrified that you might break out, I would try this one. And it's, it's gonna look yellow. Um, that's how you know, too. If you go in the store, um, I know a lot of different makeup stores sell it and they let you get samples. You'll know the difference because the other one is brown and this one is, like, yellow. It looks like pee pee. It does. That's the only way I can describe it. It looks like pee. And you can use this the same way. I would get a scrub, a peel or something, and then I would put this on right afterwards, and it will do you one day. last product, which is really good for if you have many dark spots, if you um, don't, if you want everything gone in a paisley kind of manner, but not super fast, but you do want things gone, but you want it to be a very, um, am I spitting? Like, I knock that damn water what the heck? but yeah if you want like your darks <laughs> like what the heck but yeah if you want your dark spots gone but you don't want them to be gone you know very harshly and like chemically like my first pick was or if you kind of just want everything to be even and more brighter then I will go with this this is vitamin C um serum and this is all I believe it's all Hendrickson um is the name but i if it's wrong i will leave it below and also in the description box to kind of like fix my mistake but i believe it's o henderson and this is um how it looks it's like really bright almost goldish color and it looks like very oily and it is a vitamin c serum it has three times the vitamin c of an orange so it has a lot compacted in this little bit and a little goes a long way um if you guys didn't know vitamin c is like a natural lightener a lot of times when you see people on youtube or other things they always have like some type of vitamin c serum or something when they have dark spots this stuff works really good um i would use this for all over um i just wanted to pick this up and show you guys there another option for if you do have many dark spots and you want to see a little slight improvement you won't get a huge improvement like quickly but you will see an improvement i think on the back it said give it about three months or four months and you will see a big change um but this is a really good way if you want to get rid of stuff but also it's very um it's not very strong so it's not going to give you some drying you don't have to worry again about sunscreen stuff it doesn't have that lightning strong medicine component like the first one 
but it will get the job done it just will be a little longer time but um a lot of people love this one uh, a lot of people use it for like a daily thing um it, a lot of people use it also to kind of avoid dark spots so say they are prone to breakouts they'll use this and they'll use it even before they break out just to kind of avoid getting dark spots so this is another pick of mine um but out of all of these three i really like the first one for me because it worked in two weeks it worked really fast but the other two are just as good but yeah I just want to kind of do this video to show you guys um, products that I've been using and things that help me again all these items are pricey they are within the price ring of about 60 and 70 dollars um, so they are expensive but you don't have to get exactly what I got or you don't have to get everything you can only get one and kind of use that but if you struggle with dark spots it is a good investment to spend that on products so yeah um i will probably start doing more like products like skincare and makeup reviews because i've been getting a lot of skincare and makeup and things of that sort so i will do more videos hopefully um if i'm not busy like so yeah so if you guys like this video make sure you um watch for more you leave comments questions and concerns and as always thank you guys so much for watching i will also leave all the information in the description box so you guys can check it out so thank you guys bye